All right, everybody's doing a little video on uh, Easter, so I thought I'd do mine, and, and I'm waiting to do my part. I'm supposed to put some stuff on the grill, but they want me to wait for a little bit until we get some of the stuff done in the kitchen. But anyhow, um, we want to put something, roll pan or something on the back of the 40, and I picked this bumper up a few days ago. A buddy of mine's got a 1960 uh, Sunbeam, and he had a bunch of old extra parts he gave me. And this bumper was in there. It was kind of green from the copper, you know, platings. And I took an SOS to the thing, cleaned it up a little bit, and it looks pretty cool. But it had like some little tails on it right here that come way over here. And I took and cut them off and radius this out. I'm going to radius a little bit more at the bottom. And uh, my uncle had given me this little 46, 47 Chevy backup light. Pretty cool. I already had the little bracket on the bumper, so it was perfect. And then I, uh, I've had this uh, tag light around for years. And any, I should have done a video before, I guess, but I've got an old walk around video on the truck, so you could go look at it. It had like a little rinky dink plastic one just to get something on there. But anyhow, this is off like an old 40s travel trailer. And yeah, got that on there. And of course, I got my resitch bung up in there. And uh, I like it. I like the bumper on there. It ties the, it ties the back of the truck in kind of, you know, where you just aren't looking way up underneath at the tires. It just, I don't know. I like it. And I uh, also picked up a, an old 40s bumper with some bumper guards that I'm going to cut down and put on the front also. But anyhow, I hope you all had a good Easter. I guess that's about it.